Woo! It's been a minute or two, hasn't it? Mercy. Well, um, I think it's time for a Tuesday tip. What do you guys think? It's only been like four months since I've done a video, so uh, I think I owe you guys one or two, right? So most people don't know that there's an emulator built into the data collectors. TSC7, uh, TSC5, it's, it's built into Access. <clears throat> and there's an emulator, so when you're kicking it back on the couch watching a ball game, you're going to actually be playing with your data collector and collecting points if you want to. So, oh, first things first. Okay, so most people aren't aware that there's a GNSS emulator built into Trimble Access, so whether that's TSC7, TSC5, if you're lucky enough to have a TDC 600, it's got access on it, there's an emulator built into it, okay? I'm gonna show you guys how to get to it. So the first thing you wanna do is you wanna create a job, right? So in, you need some coordinates, some coordinates of where you're gonna play at. So I've pulled up Google Earth on the computer and I've got the, um, I need the latitude and longitude for where my base is at, where my rover's at, okay? So what I'll do, and actually you can just key in the rover, you ain't gotta do the base. Um, if I go to about and I go down here, you'll see escape, legal, and support. If you go to support, there's GNSS emulator right down there at the bottom. Hidden in plain sight, right? So I would recommend opening up the joystick. So, uh, I've got a latitude and longitude in here. Um, let's point 22. It's automatically going to populate the north, 89, 1625, point 70 west. Okay, so uh, rover location. Let's just move this. Let's pretend like we're out front out here. So, um, 305026, 305026. Let's back this up. Um, 43. Enter. Twenty-five point seven two. West. Make sure you put the west in there. It'll automatically populate the north, but make sure you put west in there, otherwise you'll end up in Timbuktu. Except. Okay. So when this uh, emulator pops up here. You want to minimize it, don't close it. Minimize that. Okay, so now we have the joystick over here on the side. So now if I just go to measure, I go to RTK, say measure points, CMRX, accept, radio, accept, receiver internal, building base, accept. Okay, so now we can do whatever, right? So if we want to, um, let's say we want to store point number one, we want to call it CP, topo point, you can grab this thing and move it out of the way if you need to. Uh, antenna height, we're going to say two meters. Bottom of quick release, all looks good. I'm going to get rid of that. Oops, move this back over here. And I'm going to say measure. Store. Observation stored. Okay, so that stored that point. Let's get our scale down here a little closer. I'll say 20 foot. Okay, now then on the GNSS joystick, what you want to do is you can um, you can hold down on it, and you will see it's going to move that point up here. Okay, so measure. Store. Observation stored. There you go. So now you just stored point number one, number two. So now you can just store a few points, play around with it, do whatever you want to do. Um, you know, if I wanted to stake out and I say I want to stake out lines. Now this thing's in my way again. Line name. I could say two points. Start point 
number one, endpoint number three, whoops, endpoint number two, two, um, station online, blah, 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 antenna height, da, 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 start, and then as I use my joystick, you're going to see me moving, right? Ain't that cool? So, if you wanted to sit there and play um, with your data collector, you know, while you're, you know, in the office, maybe a rainy day, um, maybe while the wifey's watching a chick flick, be a good time to pull out data collector, wouldn't it? So anyways, uh, just kind of a little quick little tip. I just wanted to throw at you guys. I wanted to get something out to you. Um, got some other stuff I'm working on. Uh, hopefully I'll be able to get it out to you soon. So, uh, as always, like and subscribe. Probably should say that at the first instead of at the end, right? That way you watch it all the way to the end. So, um, I got lots of cool things coming up. Um, I got this... Um, accurate invert thing we're going to play with a little bit maybe with the next week or two i've got a sales meeting this week and then i've got um i need to go back to arkansas and finish working on that house um the one that i scanned with the x7 so um anyways guys god bless thank you for watching if i haven't responded to your message on youtube it's because i've been super super busy so anyways guys love you take care be careful and I'll see you in the next video.